Hi, this is Graham Helfrich, Technical Advisor Manager for the Engineering Software here at IHS Market. Welcome to the weekly Did You Know episode where we learn how to do something of value that you probably didn't know about your IHS Market engineering software. There's this really cool thing called anamorphic art. And the cool thing about it is when you look at it from the right perspective, it actually makes sense. Okay, so this is the same painting, but it only makes sense when you look at it from the right way. Here's a few more examples. So these are some kind of seemingly random patterns drawn in a building, but when you have the right perspective, it has the effect like this. Here's another example. This is inside a building, and then when you're standing in the right place, it looks like this. And these are really cool because they don't really make sense until you're looking at it the right way. And just like when you're doing reservoir engineering, it all matters on your point of view. Okay, so imagine if you could take the results from Harmony and add this kind of perspective to understand what's driving your well performance. And that's what we're going to talk about today, combining Spotfire and RTA to decide and determine what is driving our well performance using our URM results. So here we are in Harmony Enterprise. I've got about 60 wells. They've all had RTA done, so they have a URM, they have a reservoir model done. And one of the challenges in the past is if we wanted to compare URM results for multiple wells, we'd have to send them to the comparison plot. But the problem with this is it's really cumbersome and it's not dynamically linked back to the well. It's, this is like a very static picture. So as a solution, we've built a connection to a Spotfire called Harmony Analytics. So this is an optional product or connection that you can get. Just contact me or your account manager if you're interested. And this is available for customers who are on Harmony Enterprise version 2019.3 or newer. And this came out in December of 2019. So what happens is when you click export to Harmony Analytics, it's going to launch Spotfire if you have a license. Now this Harmony Analytics connector is going to let you transfer all the attributes, production history, reservoir input properties, and results, including all your estimates of permeability, fracture conductivity, volume, etc., as well as your flowing material balance and URM data points. Okay. Once we've selected everything we want to go into Spotfire, we just hit load data. So in Spotfire, I've got all my URMs visible to me now for all 60 wells. I've got them colored by their individual well name, but I want to start to color them by well attributes to see if there's some sort of relationship between what I'm seeing here and something I know about the well, like net pay, lateral length, prop and type, etc. So let's change our color to net pay. Okay, it looks like there's only two wells here that have abnormally high net pays and the rest are pretty similar, so that doesn't seem to be too important. Lateral length, okay, well, the darker colors are wells that have longer lateral length and they seem to be trending towards the stronger wells, so that could be something. What about AC, fracture surface area? Okay, again, similar thing. It seems to be influencing the strength of my URM for the 60 wells. But let's change it to something else that we have control over, like our prop in type. Okay, so the red wells are my sand prop in, and then the blue are using the ceramics. So this is interesting. It really seems in these 60 wells that the ceramic propped wells have a much stronger linear flow parameter than the other wells. Now we can even view this on a map. So we can see our ceramic wells, our sand wells, and if we pick the ceramic wells, we can send these back into Harmony as a group to look at in more detail. We'll call this our Okay, and boom, it's automatically connected back to Harmony. And we can see that those wells are put in a group and I can look at them more deeply using rate transient analysis. 
Okay, now I've just barely touched a tiny piece of the insight that you can get combining Harmony results with Spotfire using this Harmony Analytics connector. So what does this mean for you? Well, I mean comparing URMs. We all want to do that. We want to lay them over top of each other. We want to have it dynamic and that's what we've been able to achieve here. Next, what is driving our well performance, right? Sometimes we have to stand back and look at information in a different way to really understand what's going on. And that's it. I want to thank you for your time. If you have any questions, give me a call or email and subscribe to be notified of next week's episode. Thank you.